I'm glad you're up. What? What's going on? Your legs are a little crooked. I can't do anything about it. Mm, I don't know why you can't. We'll sort that out later. Later? What do you mean, later? Hmm. Oh, looks like you fixed the problem already. Partly, yeah. So, what do you need, Raph? Hmm. Let's um, get you more presentable, shall we? Presentable? What does that mean? Here. Here, let me move this. Where are you going? Shh. Just wait. Sorry about this, guys. Now I'm back. There. Look at me. <sighs> I missed doing this. Missed? What do you mean? I missed doing this, Leo. You are so much fun. If you think that you can get out of here on your own, I don't think so. Besides, you need someone to break those cups. I don't think you can be able to break them with your strength. My strength can break anything, Raph. I doubt it. You do not lift weights like I do. Grunting won't save you.
I'm gonna have a bird from that kicking me. That's hit number one. Let's see how many times he hits me. I guess the only entertainment I have is the ceiling and the floor or the ground. Whatever Rack does up there, it's kind of gross. Because it's fun. Do you think it's fun? You should be doing this to our enemies, Wrath. Not to me. Don't take your anger out on me. Take your anger out on Shredder and his... And his... Um, henchmen. What have I ever done to you? You annoy me, Leo, with your lecturing, your Captain Ryan stuff, your Space Hero stuff. That's about to take a nice little turn. What do you mean? I, all I did was care for you. I helped you when you got hurt. I helped you when you felt bad about something, and, well, we helped each other out with everything. We're best friends, Rath, and we're brothers. Please don't do this. Remember the few fights that we had before? Oh, you're still mad about those? Yep. Uh, there's, uh, I thought you were over those. I was. Until they kept coming back to me over and over again. Your words are stuck in my head, Leo. They can't leave. Can't leave? Yes. Just like you can't leave. That's because you're my family, Rav. If I leave you, Shredder will kill you. Do you want that to happen? Then you need a fearless leader and a big brother around to protect you and take the hit for you. Do you have any idea how many hits I took for you last year? A whole bunch. I don't remember any of that, Leo. Remember in our battles with the Shredder? I took a few hits for you, and you never said anything to me. You just kept on fighting and forgot about what I did. I always thought that you were just thinking about what I did for you. Were you? Of course I was. I was just focused on finishing the battle or the fight. I always wanted to do this, but thank you for taking those hits for me, even when I couldn't really see it or didn't really see it. You're welcome. I'll always take hits for you, even though you don't really want me to. I'll always do it because I love you. You love me? Yes. More than anything else in the world. You're my little brother, Rav. And you always will be. No matter where I am, no matter what happens, you will always be my little brother. Just remember that, okay? You will always be my little brother. I love you, Rathy. I love you too, big brother. 
Yeah. Did you chat? We just did. But I, I enjoy talking to you. You you are an interesting person. I am? I am that interesting? Yes. And I've always dreamed that you would be this interesting. And I guess my dream actually came true for that. So, um, what do you want to talk about, Leo? I, I don't know, like, um, what were you doing before you captured me and stuff? Oh, well, it was good. I was, um, playing video games with Mikey, and then... I beat Mikey up a little bit, and of course you stopped me from doing that, and then I trained with you and the others, and then that's just about it. Wow. Did you lift some weights? Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, I did. Okay. Is that it? Yeah. Just did those things, and now here we are talking to each other. Okay, well, um, are you gonna take me somewhere, or are we just gonna stay like this? I guess stay like this. I have no other plans for you, so I guess that will just be it. here. But how do I do it? I don't have a key with me. Come on, come on. it. I don't know. I, 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 not so fast. Give me that. 
No. Give it to me. Raph. What's going into you? Nothing. I just... I just want to keep you here. Why is that? Because... We're best friends, Leo. Don't you want to hang out with me? Raph, this is crazy, okay? I can't hang out with someone right now that does this to me. You have any idea how much pressure I'm in? Or, do you know how much pressure I'm under right now? Um, no. A lot of pressure. If I'm pushed under a lot of pressure, then... I can't handle it. Just let me escape. Please, I need to go. But Leo, just... Too tight, Leo. Leo? Oh, his pocket knife. What's that doing out? Oh, he tried to escape. Okay. Don't worry, Leo. I got you. You will be okay, I promise. Okay, Leo. Ready for mo Leo? The door's open. He escaped. Meanwhile, outside of um, Raph's mini hideout, Almost there, Leo. Hold on. You have bruises all over. You look pretty um bad. Leo, wake up. April, did you find Leo? He's right here. Leo. Are you all right, bro? Johnny, is that you? Yes, it's me. Are you okay? I'm fine. Who's carrying me? Oh, that's um, that's April. Your um, 
leaning on. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, April, if I'm too heavy for you. No, not at all. You're perfectly fine. You're my best friend, and you're like a brother to me. Of course I'll help you. Thanks, April. You're welcome. Oh, and uh, here are Leo's weapons and a uh, pocket knife. Thank you, April. You're welcome. Alright, Leo. Wait right here, okay? Alright, okay. Leo! Not right now, Mikey. Uh, I'm hurt pretty bad. Oh, okay. What happened? I'll tell you later, but for right now, I want to see Splinter. Okay. Wait, Dad? Yes, Donatello, what is it? There is someone you need to see. Okay. Where is Leonardo? Um, I'll tell you that in a minute. I'll tell you the whole story. Well, Leo will. Here's Leo. Leonardo, are you alright? I'm fine. I'm just hurt pretty bad. Yes, he has bruises all over. All of his bruises are red. Hmm. Well, that's not too bad. It isn't? It isn't? No, not at all. April. Yes? Can you give me my son, please? Oh, sure. Oh, you okay, Splinter? Sorry about that. No, you're fine. It's okay. You okay, Leonardo? I'm fine. Just a little weak. I'll be fine. Oh, my son. My poor son. <laughs> Dad? Yes? I love you. I love you too, my son. There you are, Leo. I suppose you saved him. I was walking through here and I found him. He wasn't looking so good, so I helped free the rest of him. Well, his one hand or arm. And I helped him get here. Thank goodness he's okay. Well, he's not gonna be for long. Come here, Leo. Don't worry, my son. I'll protect you. Donatello, Michelangelo, grab him. Who? Raphael. Okay. Okay. No! Get off of me! No! Stay away from Leo! Stay away from him. Get off of me! Get off of me! Sorry, Raph. It's for your own good. We're trying to keep Leo safe so that you don't hurt him anymore. He's pretty much bruised. What did you do to him? I only kicked him. That's all I did. You kicked your own brother and best friend? Yes. I was only mad and I wanted to take my anger out on him. You can't do that, Raphael. You can't do that. 
One day later, let me go, let me go. No, you hurt Leo pretty badly. He is pretty bruised up. What did you do to him? I only kicked him. You kicked your own brother and best friend? Yes. <sighs> you are grounded for a few weeks. I don't care right now, okay? You're grounded for a few weeks. I deserve that. Okay. Um, Dad? Yes, Leonardo? What is it? I forgive Raph. Why? I get that he was mad at me, but... He, um, he... I think him taking his anger out on me was actually a pretty good idea. Why do you think that, my son? Why do you think that? Because he was angry, and he didn't have any other way to let out his anger. It's true. I really didn't have any other ideas of how to let it out. So you captured... So you decided to capture Leonardo to do that. Yeah? I am very disappointed in you, Raphael. Next time I find you doing this to any of your brothers and best friend, you will be severely punished. Understood? Yes, Dad. Understood. Good. Um, Daddy? Yes? You don't have to be so hard on Raffy. I understand, Michelangelo. But you see, I'm your father and sensei and master, okay? I'm here to protect you and I'm responsible for you for to be alive, okay? Uh, of course, daddy. Thank you. Sorry for the disrespect and sorry for um, questioning you. Thank you, Michelangelo. Will you be all right, Leonardo? I think so. I'll be fine. Does anyone have a medical kit for my um for my son to use? I do. Here, Leo. Thanks, April. You're a good friend. You are too. And you're welcome. I'll go bandage myself up. You two, take Raphael to his room so he can think about what he's done, okay? And lock him in there for a few minutes and then let him out, okay? All right. Okay. If he needs to go to the bathroom, we'll let him out for that, okay? All right. Okay. If he needs food, just let him out for that too, okay? All right. Okay. No TV for him until he has thought about what he's done, okay? Alright, okay. We'll check on Leo. Yeah, we'll check on him. Oh, and April? April? Yeah? Thank you for saving our brother. Yeah, thank you for saving him. You're welcome. You saved my son's life, April. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I have no idea what would have happened to him if you hadn't showed up at the right moment or the right time to help him. Well, I'm glad I showed up. I'm glad I was walking by. And if I didn't, who knows what would have happened next to Leo. I know. It would have been very hard to think of. Oh! Leo, your pocket knife and your uh, katanas or uh, sword, your swords. Oh, thanks, April. You're welcome. Now, um, should we start training, Sensei? Oh, that's right, we should. My sons, April and I will be in the training room if you need us, okay? Okay, okay, all right. Come on, let's go.